you had to name a child after a grape variety, which variety would it be and why? Welcome to the Italian Wine Podcast Lockdown Series. Every Monday we'll be connecting with Italian wine people. Join us to find out what they're doing and drinking today. This podcast is brought to you by Colangelo and Partners, the leading fine wine and spirits agency in the US. Visit Colangelo and Partners on www.colangelopr.com. Buongiorno. Buongiorno. Ciao. Ciao. How are you, Matteo Aschieri? Ah, quite well, you know. At home. Yeah. Where are you right now? At home. Yeah, drinking a good glass of Barolo 2016. So, okay. Oh, actually, I am uh, home as well, here in New York, drinking a... Ah, wow. 2015, I picked up at the Barolo Barbaresco World Opening last month. Fantastico. Okay, great. Perfect breakfast for lockdown. Chin chin. Salute. Yes. Salute. So tell me, now that you have been home, how many weeks have you been home now on lockdown? I don't know exactly. <laughs> a lot, by the way. The time it's is the, just the beginning of March. Since the beginning of March. Oh, it's wow. a long time. Okay. Yeah, but we're not looking backwards, we're looking forwards. I mean, that, okay, regarding the, the next day, hopefully everything will be better in the future. Great. So well, look. listen, now that you are home, I've been home for a month now, would you say that you are drinking more Barolo or less? <laughs> Definitely more. Definitely more. more? <laughs> and eating also a lot, as you can see from my face. What? Yeah. What's your favorite uh, pairing that you've been uh, cooking along with your bro? <laughs> Homemade pasta with chicken liver fig figatini, chicken liver uh, sauce is fantastic. Ravioli, okay, all good stuff, by the way. <laughs> <laughs> In Piemonte, okay, we have great things, great wines, but also great food. Thanks, God. So we are surviving yes. well, surviving in a difficult way, but in a good way, talking about the food. Yeah. Amazing. So I have a question. There you go. If you had to name a child after a grape variety, which variety would it be and why? To name a child with a grape varietal name? Yeah. Oh, it is a nightmare for a child. <laughs> no, I mean, that. I would never do these kind of things. Uh, okay, it could be, okay, Arnais talking about uh, local grapes that literally in our dialect it means a little rascal so okay but could be dangerous at the end of course if, if we are girl maybe Bar barbera who knows yeah exactly Let's go. barbera aschieri that's that's a good name yeah, yeah okay good work <laughs> yes exactly amazing um so, say, yeah. uh, for, for a boy dolcetto is a good name eh? dolcetto is bad. why Alcetto, a little sweet one, yeah, it's perfect. A little yeah. sweet one. So yeah. all these grapes, it's their personality that has given them their name. It's the same as children. So if, a child, if a child was named, named Nebbiolo, for example, what would be their personality? Complex. 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 Yeah, exactly. Very profound, very uh, deep, you know, not easy to, but okay. In this way, yeah, it's good, good, good. It's a good comparison. Yes, exactly. So we talked about what you've been eating and what you've been drinking on during lockdown this past month. But tell me something. If you yeah. could choose one song to summarize your time in lockdown, what would it be? Uh, okay, I'm a, I'm a fan. I'm a great fan of Depeche Mode. Let's say Enjoy the Silence is really a great song for this. Enjoy day. the salads? Enjoy the silence. Oh, enjoy the enjoy silence. The silence. Yes. I don't know how that goes. Yeah, it goes well. It's a great, great song. Can you yeah. can you sing for me? I don't know how it goes. No, I've never please, heard please. No, we will ruin all the interview. Please don't. <laughs> okay. But you can find easily the Peshmode, exactly. The Peshmode. Yeah. Okay. I'm gonna look it up. Yeah, enjoy the silence, yes. Enjoy the silence. Yeah, it's perfect for these days. So, name three wines that are always open in your cantina. OK, 
Okay, my wines, of course, because we are drinking our wines. But apart this, I like a lot uh, wines made with Pinot Noir. Pinot Noir is a varietal similar to Nebbiolo for many kind of reasons. So coming one coming from Burgundy or from Italy, from Alto Adige, mm -hmm. outside Italy, the New World, Oregon. These are the great expression of the Pinot Noir in the world, in my opinion. Or some great wines like Viognier that I like a lot. Or a Grunel Veslina, that is an Austrian wine. Is of course a part of our Piedmontese wines. You are a wine lover, you can tell. Uh, you can see my shape. Wine and food lover is, is undoubtedly is something that you can really imagine. Not imagine, it's very simple to understand at the end. <laughs> so if you had, to, if you were only able to choose one wine for the rest of your life to drink, that wasn't yours, what would it be? Ah, babe, okay, right, okay. <laughs> <laughs> okay, is the uh, uh, man, yes, maybe one, one Pinot Noir coming from Burgundy, definitely one of the best, especially over there. Yes. Absolutely. Amazing. Very classical. I'm a classical boy too, yeah, so. A classic, you like the classic yeah. expression? Yeah, so, yes, yes, exactly. But talking about wine and food, I'm reliable, so. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> um, so you talked about what was the best meal that you've had so far in lockdown? <laughs> Every day, you know, I have my wife, my mother, that you know, always cooking all day. <laughs> so every day is a surprise. And the ravioli with meat stuff, fantastic. Uh, Tayarin, you know, homemade pasta, typical from, uh, from our region. So you, you have children, right? Yes, I have two boys. Yes, exactly. Two boys. Um, are they uh, planning to follow your footsteps? Yeah, they're just starting now. Okay, they're enjoying uh, the winery and all the other activities that, that we have. How old are your kids? Uh, I was 26, uh, 20, and the first one was 29. Yeah. So. So which child would you say would be more of the Dolcetto and which one was more of the Nebbiolo? Uh, the first one, uh, Giacomo, is more than Nebbiolo, of course. The second one, uh, uh, his name like me, Matteo, is much more, uh, let's say, like a Dolcetto, is an easy one. And uh, the third one, Andrea, Andrea is a male name. Uh, let's say, yeah, more an Arnaise. Yeah, more, more, rascal. more a rascal, more a little rascal. <laughs> Not little, little because, okay, it's baby, but okay, a rascal. Amazing. Um, so what other hobbies do you have besides uh, winemaking? <laughs> to eat a lot, yes, exactly. Okay, this is good, yeah. <laughs> to eat a lot? Are you a chef? No, I'm not a chef. I'm a, I am eat. I don't, Quality I don't like... control. Yes, exactly. We have also a restaurant and the officially quality controller over there. Restaurant is run by my sister. No, I like to, to travel when this was possible. So I'm really hoping to come back to this kind of thing, to be in the nice seaside, to 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 go to the movie to see nice movies. What's the uh, last uh, film you've seen? I see. Okay, now in these days I, we have a lot of opportunity to see on, on TV. I saw a movie called The Post uh, regarding uh, Washington Post. The big scandal. Ah. Yeah. Exactly. Then I saw Apollo 13 and all this, kind of, and then uh, all the movie of a um, uh, filmmaker that is called Sergio Leone. This is my uh, favorite. Once upon a time in America and all this kind of things. Uh, who's your favorite actor? Favorite actor, uh, let's say, okay, Tom Hanks is a good actor. Tom Hanks is good. Tom Hanks, exactly. And then, uh, yeah, many other, Clint Eastwood, of course different expressions. Yeah, these are the two. You can, can you do any Clint Eastwood expressions? Uh, not really. <laughs> Sergio Leone was saying there is only two expressions, with or without the hat. <laughs> so, <laughs> I don't, I'm, I'm much more, you know, it's difficult to, to find a comparison with Clint Eastwood on my, my page. But okay, I like right. All right. Well, thank you so much, Matteo. Grazie. Thank for joining you very much. Me today. Okay. Chin was chin fantastic. To you. Cheers. Okay. Cheers to Barolo. Cheers to you and your family.
Grazie, ci vediamo presto. Sì, grazie. Prego, ciao. grazie a te. Ciao. ciao, ciao. ciao. See you next Monday for another virtual wine journey Italian wine podcast lockdown series.